let's be honest, we all love to look our best. And we all have our own different types of style. And this definitely isn't mine. That's more like it. But have you ever stopped and thought about what you wear and what damage it can be causing to the environment? Well, here's a few facts I found out. In the UK, we buy around 60 billion pounds worth of clothes every year, and that's more than any other country in Europe. According to a recent survey, the average person owns 76 items of clothing, but throws away about six items every month. And right now, less than 1% of the material we chuck out is recycled into new garments. Let's face it, we can't escape adverts for fashion and deals from clothes shops online, but the main reason we buy so many clothes has got to be the incredibly low prices. Take a look at this t-shirt, for example, and guess how much I paid for it. Was it 20 pounds, 10 pounds, or two pounds? Well, the answer is two pounds. It sounds like a bargain, and fast fashion, as it's often called, does help to make clothes affordable for everyone. But you should be really careful when clothes are this cheap, as it can mean they're of poor quality and they won't last long. The best advice is to always check out how your clothes have been made. To find out more about this, I'm going to ask for some help, and I know just the person. Izzy Manuel is an expert on sustainable fashion. Hi Izzy, thanks for talking to me. Thank you so much for having me, it's such a pleasure. So, we all love a good deal, right? But should we be wary of things like my two pound t-shirt? I think when it comes to products that are that cheap, we have to think about how they're made and who they're made by. So some clothing stores are sustainable and are ethical, but sadly not all of them are. And when something is that cheap, often the garment workers are the ones that have to pay for that, which means that they're the ones that are working in unethical conditions, they may not be paid a living wage, and actually there's an estimation that only 2% of garment workers worldwide actually paid living wages. And what about the cost to the environment of fast fashion? Is that a problem? I think this is something that's not really talked about that often, but fast fashion is actually so detrimental to the environment. So for example, for a single pair of jeans, it actually requires 10,000 litres of water to make them, which is equivalent to 125 full bathtubs worth of water. And I think when you think about the chemicals involved in processing of garments, whether that's dyeing, washing, cleaning, all of that adds up, and often this water and this toxic waste ends up in rivers, which is obviously really unsustainable. So what can we do about all of this? Well, one obvious solution is to just buy fewer clothes. It saves you money and it helps the environment. The truth is that too many of us are buying new outfits, knowing that we'll probably only wear them a few times before we throw them away. But does ditching fast fashion mean you're going to look a bit rubbish? Absolutely not. For example, I am wearing a full secondhand outfit today and personally, I feel like I look all right. Just because you don't buy fast fashion anymore doesn't mean that you don't have to look cool, doesn't mean you won't look trendy. And there are so many ways around that. For example, you can swap with your friends, you can buy secondhand, you can go to charity shops. All these things can still create a wardrobe that you love that isn't as impactful on the environment. One other top tip is that when you put your clothes in the washing machine, try to use a lower temperature. It helps your clothes to last longer and reduces the amount of microplastics that are released from fabrics like polyester or nylon. Izzy, what else can we do to help tackle the problem? I think one of the things that we could definitely do more is actually learn to repair our clothes, do small alterations. For example, do you actually know how to use a sewing kit? It's actually the best thing ever. And it's a great way to maintain our clothes, to fix small holes, and it means it keeps up in our wardrobes for longer. Thank you, Izzy, that's brilliant advice. Thank you so much for having me and I hope it was helpful. So what have I learned? Well, it is possible to look great without it having to cost the earth. And instead of fast fashion, maybe the answer is to get fashion that lasts.